And our correspondent in Washington, Alina Duarte, who continues to follow the action, spoke with prominent civil rights activist, Reverend Jesse Jackson. Hold on for your democracy, fight for democracy. Uh, there are rabble forces in, in, in Venezuela, both of them are Venezuelans. We care for both sides of the war. Both of them are people, both of Venezuelans. We must, in fact, choose reconciliation over confrontation. We need the UN involved. They go to the bargain table, wave the belt. There'll be no winners where one group kills off the other group. We must have a commitment to healing and reconciliation, not confrontation. We, we care for all of them on both sides of the struggle. We must end the war and choose peace. What's your opinion about Trump's with, like, policy on war around the world? Well, Trump unashamed to choose the oil over, over human rights. Uh, his, his, his trade war with China is going to hurt a lot of people. It's going to hurt a lot of Chinese. It's going to hurt a lot of Americans. His, the, our war with Iraq is not over. And, and uh, Syria is not over. We overthrew Libya. It was not fair. Uh, now we're looking at uh, North Korea and Iran. We're fighting ourselves into isolation. The more we fight, the more isolated we become. The more we fight, the more isolated we become. I'm convinced a new peace movement will be born based on the Venezuelan struggle. A new peace movement will be born in this country. Venezuela is, 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 is in our hemisphere. Venezuela is in our hemisphere. These are our neighbors. Venezuela is not foreigners. They're down the Pan American Highway. These are our neighbors. We must end the war. We must, we, we, we're stopping food in Venezuela. We're stopping food, we're stopping water. We cannot, we, we, America is stopping the people of Venezuela, not Maduro. Trump is cutting off food, and cutting off water, cutting off supplies. We're trying to starve Venezuela's submission. We must not do that. And Venezuela must not give up. They must not surrender their spirits, their fight for self-determination.